According to Brett Siegel from NBA, the Philadelphia 76ers are willing to give up a first round pick for DeMar DeRozan. Daryl Morey and the Philadelphia 76ers do not want to give up a first round pick ahead of their trade deadline, but would be willing to do so for a player like DeRozan. Ah, where do I begin here? Where do I begin here? This is a guy that just, yes, he can score. Yes, he can put up uh, stats. Yes, he can, um, uh, yes, he can go into mid-range. He's like a mid-range assassin, right? But I don't want DeRozan. I do not want DeRozan at all. He, I don't think he fits. I don't think he fits with the Philadelphia 76ers. I don't think so. You need someone who can actually shoot the three. In his career, he is... Hold on. In DeMar DeRozan's career right now, he is averaging 500% from three. No, wait. No, it's not. That's not right. That's definitely not right there. Um... Here we go. Hold on. DeMar DeRozan is averaging just under 300% or 30% from three. Just under 30% from three. He is known for his mid-range. There is no way in the world that the Sixers should give up a first-round pick for him. There's no way. We just got our first-round picks. The Philadelphia 76ers just got their first-round picks because of the James Harden trade. Credit to Daryl Morey there. It just doesn't make sense why you will waste the first round pick on DeMar DeRozan. The fit is just not there. He is not a leader. He can score, but he's just not what the Sixers team is looking for. What the Sixers are looking for are a ball handler, a backup ball handler, a three point shooter, Clay, uh, not Clay. Um, DeMar DeRozan is not a three point shooter. He can defend, yes, but I don't think he can step up when it matters the most. He can't do that whatsoever. So, just for DeMar DeRozan, if I had to get him, uh, I'd rather have Tobias Harris than DeMar DeRozan right now. I'm keeping the buck. I'd rather have Tobias Harris because he can shoot the three. He can defend. Uh, he can do everything that uh, everything does that uh, he, Tobias Harris, all right. DeMar DeRozan can do everything that Tobias Harris can, except for the fact that Tobias Harris is a better shooter than DeMar DeRozan. So on that aspect, DeMar DeRozan is not a player that should come to the Sixers. DeMar DeRozan should not be a player that should be on the radar. The only Chicago Bull player I want from the, Plo- from the Bulls is Andre Drummond. That's the only player I want from the Chicago Bulls. If we could get Andre Drummond and DeMar DeRozan, which I highly doubt, then I'll take it. But DeMar DeRozan is a guy we desperately, not DeMar DeRozan, but uh, Andre Drummond is a guy we desperately need right now. So if we could get Drummond as a backup center with Joel and B being out, I would totally take that. I would never grab DeMar DeRozan right now in a trade deadline. No, I'd rather have Klay Thompson I'd rather have Malcolm Brogdon. I'd rather have Spencer Dinwiddie. I'd rather have Tyus Jones. Maybe not him, but you get the point. I just want someone who can score and someone who can step up at any given moment. And that's what Klay Thompson brings. That's what Malcolm Brogdon brings. That's what uh, DeMar DeRozan is just not that guy, guys. He is not that guy. I really cannot stand DeMar DeRozan. I cannot. Yes, he has the history with Popovich. What has he done since then? Yes, Toronto Raptors, he did good. He was based, That's where he made his career off of. But the Sixers do not need DeRozan, especially in the playoffs. They don't need him now. That is not the case. I am going live on the NBA trade deadline with the guys from the Pick and Roll podcast every Wednesday at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. But if we get DeMar DeRozan, I'm going to be so mad. I'm going to be so freaking mad. There's no way in hell that we're going to get DeMar DeRozan. If it's true, it happens, I'm going to be pissed because this is a must-trade deadline. I'd rather not trade anybody 
I'd rather not give up anything for DeMar DeRozan. I'd rather not make a trade. I'd rather keep this team as is than get DeMar DeRozan. What has he done in Chicago? Nothing. What has he done in Spurs? Okay, a little bit of there. No, I will not take DeMar DeRozan. I will not. Sorry, not sorry. It is not in my cards. It is not in my cards for DeMar DeRozan. No, well. No way.